We are gathered here today to celebrate one of life's greatest moments, to give recognition to the worth and beauty of love, and to rejoice today with Michael and Amanda. Amanda Ray, look how far we've come the last 1,209 days. I've dreamed about writing this letter. It still feels like yesterday when we were only seeing each other once, maybe twice a week, and just dying to move in together. You and I have grown so much together since July 18, 2016, when we first laid eyes on each other. Michael Ryan, it's so crazy we have finally reached the day that we have talked about for years. I know when I first met you, I was going to marry you. It was already evident that you were my match as we sat at dinner. I'll never forget talking for hours and learning so much about each other so fast. Today as I write this letter to you, I wish I knew how to put into words how committed I am to you. Lord knows you bring out the best in me. And until we met, I was always on my way to you. There are two qualities that I stand out. They are loyalty and his desire to put people before himself. You know, if Mike is on your side, he's going to do anything in his power to take care of you, that he will do anything for you. These traits stand out in his relationships with people and even his career path. It takes a special kind of person to put their life on the line to help others. And Mike is that kind of person. Thank you for loving me, choosing me, and protecting me. You are my world, and I promise to love you through every single up, down, and all of the in-between. Life is complete with you as my husband. I'm glad we can check that off of our to-do list today. I'm so excited to call you my wife and put both of those rings on your finger. I love you, babe. I'll see you down the aisle. So Michael and Amanda, you have come before us and before God and have expressed your desire to be husband and wife. You have shown your love and affection by joining hands. You have made promises of faith and devotion and have sealed these promises by the giving and receiving of rings. Therefore, as an ordained minister of the gospel and upon the authority that has been given to me by the state of Florida and the word of God, I now pronounce that you are husband and wife. Michael, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, for the very first time, I present to you Mr. and Miss Michael Mathias. From this day for the rest of eternity, I vow to grow with you, learn from you, and live our days hand in hand. I promise to always be faithful to you. I promise to always love you unconditionally and always kiss you goodnight. I promise I'll always have your back and cheer you on. I'm your biggest fan. You are the man I have always searched for. I can't wait to spend forever with you and have so many adventures together. I don't know how I got so lucky to become your wife. I 
palpate for as long as my heart beats. And there's air in my lungs. I will strive to make you the happiest woman on earth. Michael, you are truly one of a kind, sticking with her, but also found one of a kind who is always going to be by your side and stick with you through everything. I love you more than all the stars in the sky, higher than the heavens, heavens and deeper, deeper than the seas. seas. More than all stars in the sky and more than all drops of water on earth.